Hey guys, I'm here. We have our first trailer for the new Texas Chainsaw Massacre, which is a sequel to the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre, which is also called, as you guessed it, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Stop it. <laughs> anyway, um, this takes place, it's doing kind of like what Halloween 2018 did. It's going back to the original, resetting the timeline, picking up what, 50 years after that original event, after that original film, and picking up with Leatherface coming back into the fold. I guess after some new kids come into town, I don't know. Um, I kind of loosely saw a little bit of the synopsis before going into this, so I'm kind of curious about it. Um, I don't think, I think the remake uh, that came out in the early 2000s was a decent uh, adaptation, a de decent retread of this, though, I feel like when it comes to the originals, the, like you, none of the none of the sequels had ever bested the first, or even come remotely close. There were some that were vastly entertaining, weird choices along the lines in some of those, <laughs> a great Matthew McConaughey performance in one. Uh, but yeah, I don't think ever, anything ever came close to replicating that first one, except for maybe the remake. Every time a new one of these uh, is announced, I'm just morbidly curious. I mean, the last one that came out kind of did the same thing, um, where we just kind of revisited the original and then came back again, whichever one that was. Wasn't it like Texas Chainsaw Massacre 3D or something like that? I can't, I can't remember what the last one was, but I remember seeing it in theaters. And uh, yeah, so... Anyway, let's see what they have to offer us this time. Uh, this one's going to be actually coming to Netflix, which is a, a change of pace. So here we go. That was cool. So Harlow is a ghost town. We have a vision for this place. All it needs is young blood. I don't want to live here. This is a chance for people to start fresh somewhere. Somewhere safe. Hey guys. You should see this. What are you doing in our house? really shouldn't be here. Oh my god. Ooh. This is hard to see. Don't breathe in uh, Evil Dead. Okay. And the original. Fifty years I've been hmm. waiting for this night. Just to see him again. <gasps> Leatherface. It's weird how hearing them actually refer to him as Leatherface. Like it's you that he wants. I'm not gonna let him kill you. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. I, I don't know if it's going for a serious adaptation at all. I don't get that vibe whatsoever from it. Uh, at the very least, it looks like we will get some very bloody, interesting kills in this one, which will be in, will fun, uh, be fun to get into. Now, um, let's read what we got here. So, I just want to see, like, the, uh, the little descriptor they actually have. Nearly 50 years of hiding, Leatherface returns to terrorize a group of idealistic young friends who accidentally disrupt his carefully shielded world in a remote Texas town. I need to go back and rewatch the original one because uh, I I forget the the girl survived. Was that who that was in the truck? 
uh, that was with these kids. He's like, I've been waiting for it to see his face again or something like that. Is that her? Is that who that was? Okay, so yes, that is supposed to be the same character that survived at the end of the first one. I just checked the uh, cast listing. Now, the original actress, that's not her. They had to recast. The original actress passed away in 2014, so... Uh, but that is definitely meant to be that same character um, coming back into the fold. I just how I want to know how they'll explain that though, because they were just kind of passing through on their way cross country, from what I remember, and they just bad luck ended up in this town, interacting with this family and getting pulled into this whole situation. So what kept, what brings her back here? What makes her stay here after all of this? Got a lot of questions, but. I guess we'll find out when it comes out. Guys, what did you think of the trailer? Sound off the comments. Let me know your thoughts down below. We'll carry on the conversation after the video. Feel free to join our Discord. We can talk about it there as well. Before we go, I want to shout out our channel legends. Manny Share, Ryan, Karen, Jason Coleman, Philly Vane, Yori Korskov, Margaret Grace, Mary Bradley, Jeffrey Hale, Nate Prouty, Emo Slytherin, and Melita. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, everybody.